Hi, Scott Rao, one of your corporate sales trainers here at Bright Health. So I'm making some videos for you here about some of the great tools that we've created for the contracting in 2020. So uh, we have some things for GAs and FMOs. We have some things directly for the agent as well. But the goal with all of it was really to make this the simplest process out there, the easiest contracting in the industry, and maybe the funnest as well. What I'm gonna talk about on this video is the contracting guide for our agents. So let me show you the process. Uh, I'll, I'll give you a demonstration of how it should look for the most part and tell you the most important things that you need to know to contract here with Bright. So here's the guide that I, I had just showed you in my hands. Uh, but you see, it's three pages. It'll take you step by step through the entire process, letting you know what you need, what the email invitation will look like. I'll show you that in a moment. Um, the like the 11-ish steps like I mentioned um, that, that you'll need to go through, topics that you'll need to cover, uh, how long it will take to, to finish up the appointment and getting you ready to sell, and who you should contact for help as well. Um, this is your frontline people right here, the broker services unit at brokers at brighthealthplan.com and their phone number. Uh, you don't have to remember it, write it down. You can always get that at, at brighthealthbroker.com as well. All right, so le let me show you what this should look like. So the first thing, if you're contracting yourself, you know, if you haven't, if you're not contracted with an FMO, um, uh, or you haven't been able to, um, you haven't received an invite to contract anywhere else, you can start right at our brighthealthbroker.com. If you're watching this video, there's a good chance though that you might have already been invited from your FMO. Let me show you this part and then I'll tell you about what you should be looking for there. So uh, if you're directly contracting with Bright Health, you just go to Let's Start Appointment right here on the main page of brighthealthbroker.com right there underneath get appointed then you select the agent appointment button and you'll type in your first name last name and your email address at that email address you will receive an online an onboarding invitation so this is what i'm talking about though if your your fmo might have already invited you um, to this contracting process as well um, oh, and so you might already have this information in your inbox from them and not have to go to brighthealthbroker.com to request an onboarding invitation. Your first time contracting with Bright Health, we supply you with your user ID, which is just the email address that we have on file for you, and a password, a temporary password for you to use at the moment. Once you log into the information there, so I'm not gonna walk through the actual contracting process. <laughs> I, I don't wanna take up too much time. That would take probably a little bit more time we want for this uh, short video um, that we're showing you here today. And I don't want you really to have all my personal information and bank account stuff either. So uh, what you'll see once you actually log into the contracting website is this, um, is this screen with the tabs across the top. It starts with, uh, starts with 10 tabs. We really don't count that submit button at the end um, because that's all that submit tab is. It's just one button, you can handle that. So, but here on each page, you do have asterisks beside any required field. And at the bottom of each page, you can save your work or click next to proceed. So once you click next, once we click next, there we go. Now it's moving for us. Um, you must answer all of the questions on each page that has an asterisk. And on the licensing tab in particular, you have to let us know which lines of business and which state you want to be contracted. Over here on the right hand side, if if this was an invitation you received from your FMO or GA, this would already be populated for you. If you have an upline um, that you want to select, we have a drop down menu here for you to be able to select the proper upline. They must already be contracted with us, of course, for you to select them. Then, if you take a look uh, on the background questionnaire, we do have to ask you some questions and we have some agreements that, that we must have you acknowledge. You do electronic signatures on. We will do that background check. You might have even saw a couple pages ago. It takes about three to five days. That's the longest part of the process. Once you submit this, um, we will do that on your behalf uh, before you get your ready to sell for us. And 
we, we will need your E&O information and your, your uh, commission assignment information. It depends how you're getting your commission assigned. What will determine which what information that we need. Um, if you're if you're paid through an agency, then we will need the the TIN, the tax identification number for that agency. If you're paying, if you want us to pay you directly, um, then we would uh, need your banking information and a W nine filled out, which we'll work with you on supply you the um, the, the the proper documents so we can get that on file. And then we will need your, your certification information. We, we will need your uh, user ID for the ACA, FFM user ID for, for any ACA individual certifications. Uh, if you're selling under 65 IFP products as we call them here. And we will need an AHIP or, or a proper um, substitute for the AHIP as well if you're selling Medicare Advantage plans for us. The extra step comes in with Medicare Advantage, as you well know, if you're if you're an agent that that uh, dabbles in that business. Uh, what you'll find is we do have that uh, that extra step, that certification that you need to go through. What we do want to emphasize, we've made this simple, and I'd like to think it's a little bit entertaining as well. I'm the, I'm the star of the show here in these these five short videos that you'll have to go through. Um, you do have uh, the self-paced compliance module and a 25 question assessment to to complete as well. So you you will submit that assessment, and you might think you're done, but don't forget you have this submit tab to go through. We have to make sure that we go to the submit tab, click the final submit button, and wait those three to five business days for the background check to go through, and we will email you a ready to sell. At any point you have any questions, here's those brokers at brighthealthplan.com and their phone number, 888-325-1747. Again, you can find that information directly on the brighthealthbroker.com website. So there you have it. Like I said, easiest contracting process in the industry and i think you'll enjoy it as well uh, let us know if you have any questions we appreciate you taking the time to contract with us here at bright health see you soon